children, I hope you're all well and doing lots of home learning with your grown-ups. Today we're going to do another rhyming game. It's called Get Off My Wagon. Okay children, remember when we do rhyming we're looking at two words that sound the same. So if I say bat and mat, they sound the same. If I say bat and bed, they don't sound the same, they don't rhyme. So let's start. First of all, we're going to look at all the things that I have that might go in my wagon. I've got a mouse, a house, a bee, a tree, a box, a fox, a plane, a train, a star, a car, a goat, a boat, a bell, a shell, a bat, a hat, a ring, a king, a snake and a cake. This is my wagon. Let's practice first of all. In my wagon there is a mouse, a house, and a cake. Which one of those doesn't rhyme? Mouse, house, cake. That's right, it's the cake. So you need to shout out children, cake, get out of my wagon. Because house and mouse rhyme. Well done children, your turn now. In my wagon, I have a plane, a star and a train. Plane, star, train. Which one of those doesn't rhyme? That's right. Star, get out of my wagon. Plane and train rhyme. Well done. The next one. I've got a bell, a shell, and a goat. Bell, shell, goat. Which one needs to get out of my wagon? Goat, get out of my wagon. That's right children, bell and shell rhyme. What's in my wagon children? It's a fox, a box, and a bee. Fox, box, bee. Which one of those shouldn't be in my wagon? Get out of my wagon, bee! Did you get it right, children? Fox and box rhyme. Well done. Now, we've got a snake, cake and king. Snake, cake, king. Which one needs to get out of my wagon? Can you shout it? King, get out of my wagon. Snake and cake rhyme. Well done. And the last one. We've got a train, a mouse and a house. Train, mouse, house. Which one doesn't rhyme and shouldn't be in my wagon? Shout it out. Train, get out of my wagon. Mouse and house rhyme. Well done, children. Fantastic rhyming today. I hope you enjoyed the game. I'll see you soon. Bye.